hello this is Nia Muder and welcome to class in today's tutorial we're going to reproduce this social media uh, flyer I just designed it now so we're going to do it together from scratch I'll do it while you follow my steps it's quite easy so let's go all right so this is pixel lab and right about now we're going to start the tutorial i like to remove this guy i don't just know why i always want to remove it then now let's get a chill that we're going to be using for the design or oh, this is the material let me get this guy first okay i've gotten this let me just hide it let me get the other guys that we're going to be using okay we're going to use this guy I'll just hide it here for now okay let's get the ch oh, sorry let's, let's get um let's get the nick sneakers perfect all right very sweet okay so is it and the background i'm going to be using is we're going to pick the background from the shoe now one way you can choose color for your design is getting the color from the picture that has been used so there's no <laughs> there's no way i'll be using a, a color that is hard because this is a uh, a product design a flower that used to to promote a product and the product have a beautiful have beautiful color okay orange font orange and um, blue so we want to pick the colors from the shoe that's the way our design will look very unique so let's pick the color here so that's the color we're picking perfect you see how beautiful it is already we can decide to pick the orange of and it's still going to still look very nice because it's part of the shoe are you seeing it it's nice right but well, let's begin with the blue first okay now now that we've done this the next thing we want to do is let me lock this guy lock it so that it doesn't move up and down okay so now we want to get some other effects in the background but then let's work on the nick first the nick test is going to come here right here and just go over there just type nick okay now this is done now we're going to use a turx that is tall a little and a turx that is also bold so we're going to make it bold perfect now let's increase it all right so this is it so i want it inside the design like this right so i want to centralize it okay it's done now what we want to do now is to make part of the two transparent on the text now that we do that we click on this guy here we copy it okay and then we'll change the color to transparent so click on plus and go to transparent okay now it's transparent now go over to what we have outline and then we add an outline to it so the outline we've added to it and then we reduce it let the outline be white and let it be reduced to maybe um okay let's say two okay two stroke width all right then we're also going to centralize this guy here sorry relative position center okay now uh, we're going to send one of it one of it's going to go to the back so the one with a full color is going to go to the back of the design and this guy is going to all right sorry something is missing here okay so the one with the transparency of this guy here is going to come to the front okay we're going to come to the front and uh we'll place it properly it's not properly placed let's place it properly i think we should make it even one stroke width and let it be properly placed I don't know why this guy is coming out but then let's see sure let's work on the other guy 
where is it again this okay so let's okay okay so I don't want this thing to show. Alright, so we are they are supposed to centralize like this. Alright, so this is what I want. This is what I want. It's okay. It's just what I wanted. Alright, so let's touch this guy. Bring it out of the video. We'll touch this guy and bring it out of the video. They are supposed to be properly centralized. I don't know what is wrong with one of them. Um, I think this guy is not here. So guy should also be normal this guy should be normal too okay so that we can place them it's not supposed to take me time I don't know what is happening alright so it's supposed to be like this sort of okay Alright, so we've placed the picture on top of the text. Now we're gonna get the other information. Okay, so let's get this other information. So this guy is gonna be a show. Show us what you can do. So that is what. Font we're gonna use, I think, what what turns. Uh, so this should be a right. So I prefer it to be on one line. Okay. So we we'll centralize it. All right. So the next thing we will do is. Get the social media handles. So let's just get the social media handles. We we'll use we we'll use our social media forms for it. Social circle. So um, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. So we'll just go back to where we have our font and choose the social media font there. See, it's supposed to be for Twitter. Twitter. Okay, got it. So this is it. The next thing that we're going to do now is um, the website address is going to be somewhere here. www.nick.com. So that is it then we'll, we'll align those things um i think we want to bring this up now it's gonna be white and um, the next thing that's gonna be there is this okay just do it Arch. Just do it. And we'll use the same font we use for link. Alright, so. Now I'll work on that. Let's let's work on the alignment.
bad. This guy is gonna be dead. This guy is gonna be here. some effect to it um, let's go to download and get this I think this guy yeah. okay so let's just bring this guy alright so I think I'm gonna make it blue and uh, alright so then we would reduce the opacity a little Send it to the back. Send it to the back then. We also send one of the nick to the back. I think this one. Send to the back. Alright, we'll send this guy to the back. So that the net effect will show on them. So we'll send these guys to the back. Let's leave this. No, let's, let's get it. So the next thing we want to do is this um, effect here. Yeah. So it's simple to add it. We we'll just you know, stretch it to our taste and then just reduce the opacity. So we'll just reduce the opacity, and uh, I think we're good to go. Right. So that's it. So we also make sure that we send it to the back. Right. So. Here you go, we're done with the design. The alignment is intact, and everything is in place. So, thank you so much. Kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and Ni Amuda TV. Make sure you subscribe and leave a comment, and we'll see you in the next tutorial.